I'm WPDE Sports Director Rich Crampanis. Thanks so much for logging on to CarolinaLive.com. We're here at Williams Bryce Stadium with extended post-game coverage of the Gamecocks 31-17 win over the Clemson Tigers. For fans in our backyard, what a play by Quinton Smith, the redshirt freshman wide receiver out of Dillon, recovered that muffed punt that set up the Brandon Wilds touchdown that sealed the deal and gave the Gamecocks their fifth straight win over their arch rival. We hear from both sides now in the post-game press conference. But to tell you the truth, uh, I don't know why we do. We, we don't talk about them all year. You know that. Uh, we, I think that was something they used to do here. Uh, we talk about the next opponent. And then the week of this game, we talk about them a little bit. Our guys play well here at Williams Price. The fans were super. They were outstanding. They, it was uh, one of the loudest we've had here. And uh, it was neat. Uh, we know we're sort of blessed. We're not that great a team. But uh, the guys hang in there and just keep on playing and uh, somebody makes a play. So it was it was a good win for all Gamecocks. It's just special, man. Special for me, special for the players, the seniors, the program. I mean, this is why we came to South Carolina. And to finish out these seniors not losing to them is, is huge. Connor Shaw is a big part of this team. You know, he take control of the uh, offense and go out there, put them in great position. And when in the crash, he just come out of there making big plays on it with his feet. So Connor Shaw is a great player. Uh, Connor, I love him to death. He's a gutsy quarterback. He's always, he's a winner. I mean, I, he he might not do everything perfect, but one thing he is is a winner. So, I mean, I'm proud to have him on my team, and I'm uh, glad that he have his, has his record. We fought hard, but we did not not play smart. Uh, had some critical penalties, but the biggest, I mean, the story of the game is the turnovers, guys. I mean, you can't turn the football over and beat good teams. Uh, I think we had four turnovers in the fourth quarter. Uh, but, but four of our turnovers, two of them were in plus territory um, and uh, two of them on punt return. So it's a difference in the game, uh, no question about it. Uh, but give, give all the credit to uh, South Carolina because they took care of the ball. Uh, Connor Shaw played tremendous, uh, just, just tremendous. What a, what, a, what, a, what a great football player he is. Uh, I have all the respect in the world for Connor Shaw. Uh, he's a great winner. There's a reason why they're undefeated here at home. There's a reason why he never lost a game here at home. Uh, he's, a, he's a tremendous competitor, and uh, I have a lot of respect for him. But obviously, uh, our locker room is hurting greatly. I know our fan base is, is hurting greatly. This is one everybody, everybody wants. And uh, listen, it's nobody's responsibility but mine. And ultimately, you know, get down and essentially turn the ball, turn the ball over six times, I mean, I don't really think a couple of those really mattered at the point, but you just, it's pretty disappointing overall. Honestly. How tough, first of all, the fumble, what happened on that play? Man, I honestly thought I was down. You know, kind of got down, I got lifted back up, the ball kind of shimmied out. Just just happened, man. You know, I was just trying to make a little extra effort, just go down. I thought my knee hit. They didn't say anything, so. It was what it was. What is it about this particular opponent that you guys seem to just really shoot yourself in the foot year after year? So. Um, you know what? That's a good question. I really don't know. We just never really played a complete and clean game against these guys. Um, you know, again, credit to those guys. They do a great job of capitalizing. But, again, I think we hurt ourselves for the most part every time we play these guys. 